Wyatt TV, and y'all know who I am. Hold on, cut, cut these damn ringers off. Ringers off, ringers off. All right, check it. Here we go. Rap Wyatt TV. I go by the name of DJ Chuck T. This right here is the Beats, Bars, and Blends podcast. And in the studio with me today, I got a Carolina rap legend, an upstate Carolina rap legend. A nigga who been doing this thing just as long as me, probably a little longer. One of the pioneers, one of the niggas who had to pay the way, lay the concrete, chop down the motherfucking trees. Goddamn, back when we was recording on, 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 on tapes, on them eight tracks, the real, the real. Them niggas don't know about the real, the real, everything digital. You know, this is back when niggas had the DAT tapes. When niggas ain't have all the uh, email me this and email me that before Pro Tools was there, before... This was back when niggas had to bring shit on a fucking floppy disk, man. Them niggas don't even know what a fucking floppy disk look like these days. But listen, we 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 done, we done already painted a good enough picture for you, man. In the studio with me today, I got the big homie Cheddar Man in here with me, man. Put your hands together for the homie Cheddar Man, man. Come on, man. Give it up for Cheddar Man. All right, all right, all right. Well, actually, it ain't Cheddar Man. Okay, okay, we got a name change. Actually, it's just Cheddar. It's just Cheddar. We done, we done already. Yeah, okay, we, yeah. well, we we gonna take it back. We gonna get to all that. We gonna get to the <laughs> to the to the movie star ass nigga. Yeah, yeah, we gonna get to okay. the goddamn <laughs> entrepreneur with the clothing store. We gonna we gonna move past the rapper. We gonna get to the name change. But we gonna take it all the way back. We gonna take it all the way back. We gonna take it all the way back, man. We gonna start with Cheddar Man and then work our way up to Cheddar. Yeah. All right. So, man. I gave everybody a little bit of background on you. So, she tell us where you represent, man, because you're from, you're from a place where it's really, really overlooked in the hip-hop scene. You see what I'm saying? Especially in the Carolina hip-hop scene. Like, everybody think Carolina country, but you from the real fucking dirt roads, man. Man, where, 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 where you from? Tell us exactly where you're from. I'm, I'm actually, I'm from a, a small town. Um, it is in the Charlotte Metropolitan. Uh -huh. um, it's in York County. It's, gotcha. Um, it's in South Carolina. You know the upper state of South Carolina. Um, probably about forty-five minutes from Charlotte. Gotcha. Okay. A small town called Sharon. You know what I mean? God like, damn, I ain't um, even heard of that thing. Yeah, like it's <laughs> it's in Western York County. Okay. Um, the biggest. The, the the biggest city in York County is Rock Hill. Rock so, Hill. you know, that's what everybody really I, I the the new people, that's what they identify me exactly. with. Exactly. Cause you know, I, I had my shop Shine Time, had my shop in Shine um in Rock Hill for probably like um seventeen, eighteen years. Damn, okay. All right, yeah. hell yeah. All right, so like I, uh, like you were saying, you're from a small town. Everybody associates it with Rock Hill. I thought you was from Rock Hill. No. You know, um, when you first got into music, you got in, excuse me, you got in at a time where it wasn't popular to rap. Also, it wasn't easy to be a rapper. You know, nowadays everything digital. A nigga can can buy a five hundred dollar computer and put five hundred dollars in the Pro Tools and buy a little three hundred dollar mic and for a thousand dollars a nigga can go on and on and just record everything. Nigga can download free beats, all that. You know, back when you started rapping, wasn't none of that shit. You know, so what made you want to even get involved in music? Well, I come from a musical background. Okay, all right. Um, you know. Uh, my my family with the most musical background is from Chicago. Oh, okay. All right. You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, they from Inglewood. Gotcha. Not, not Inglewood, California. Nah, Inglewood, 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 Chicago. If you okay. don't know what I'm talking about, then just leave it alone. You know what I mean? Just leave it alone. But, you know what I'm saying? But they from Inglewood. But, um, actually, bro, my older brother kind of he was more, you know, kind of like of an influence because he was wanting to do the music. Gotcha. But we was like, we bro, we from the country. So, you know what I'm saying? He went and did the Apollo, you know what I mean? Oh, okay. So, she, yeah. he was serious about yeah, that Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Like, he, he went and yeah. did the Apollo. Did he get booed? No, he didn't get booed. So no Sandman came. No, out. we didn't get Okay, Sandman. I was shit. He good, man. He but, ain't gotta win. You just can't get goddamn Sandman on. Well, it's like this. He didn't win. 
Okay. He didn't win the Apollo. Shit, he won if he didn't get Sandman off that bitch. But <laughs> he went, he didn't win the Apollo, okay. but like the next year, he came back to York, South Carolina and opened up a club called the Apollo. Apollo. Okay. So, I, yeah. So, you know, um, RIP my brother Quintel, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Everybody who really know me know, like, I'm I just, to be honest with you, uh, I'm just following in somewhat of his footsteps. Yes, really, yeah. really, really, he was, you, you know, carrying what I'm out his dream. Like, ain't nothing wrong like, with that. Like, really, you know? Really, like, he was the man. Like, I ain't, I ain't, listen, I would never, you know what I'm saying? Back in the day, I used to hate when they say, oh, that's Quintel, little brother. I couldn't never get my own identity. Exactly, yeah. They're like, oh, that's Quintel, little brother. You know what I'm gotcha. saying? Gotcha, nah, I feel you. But he was the man. So, you no. know what I'm saying? Later on, now I look back on it, and when people, the people who know him, like, that's Quintel, little brother, I embrace that now. Exactly. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, my, my, my brother was like, 10, 15 years ahead of his time. Got gotcha, you, got gotcha. you. Like, How'd your brother pass, if you don't mind he, me asking? He, you know, just uh, help. You know help for him. Not, gotcha. not no, nothing but, Yeah, nah, he, yeah. yeah thank yeah, God yeah. the streets ain't taking yeah, yeah, life. Nah, you know nah, what I'm saying? Just, That's real. Just help, you know what I'm saying? Um, he he uh, had a, had, you know what I'm saying, stroke, heart attack. You know, and Damn. then, you know, like, you know, where, where we from, the area, I ain't going to downplay, but the hospital, they ain't right. Yeah, no, nah, I'm saying it. he walk into the hospital and never walk back out. Shit, I'm gonna tell you a story. You know, my, my middle brother, my older brother, yeah. this nigga got shot. He got shot like four or five times. They had this nigga waiting in the waiting room, bleeding out all over the motherfucking waiting room. You know what I'm saying? We had to drive this nigga to another hospital on the other side of town. The minute we walked through the door to the emergency room, everybody rushed in, grabbed him, hooked him up, put him on a, on a stretcher, everything. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, it's it's just one of them things where you have certain hospitals in certain areas, especially if the skin tone of the demographic is a little darker than everybody, you know, and then they don't really look out for us. You see what I I'm mean, saying? I don't even look. I just look at them as just, they just, you know what I'm saying? They don't know no. They yeah. don't know nothing. I yeah. wouldn't go. I wouldn't go there with a stump toe. You know what damn, I mean? damn. It's so, that bad. <laughs> anyway, you know what I'm saying? But yeah. like with my music, man, like I actually, uh, I don't know much about the floppy disk and stuff. Like actually, bro, I. Started my first song ever. Uh uh-huh. I recorded in prison. Yeah. Hell yeah. So shit, we was gonna get to the prison shit. You know what I'm saying? But <laughs> you done already brought it up. I was gonna I was gonna try to take him in the mindset of Okay, you know, well, go ahead. You know, I was like, you do, 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 do your thing. Like, no, 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 no. We no, we gonna we gonna hop, skip, and jump. Okay. All right. So she out there in the country, you know, obviously I know wasn't much opportunity. Yeah. So a nigga naturally turned to what made the most money. Most definitely. All right? So what got you involved in the street life besides just lack of opportunity? You know what I'm saying? Well, I come from a family of hustlers. Got you. Like, um, you know what I'm saying? Like, um, I, my, my family is just hustlers. They was hustlers. Before it was cocaine and all like this, they uh-huh. was hustling. Like, they was... My granddaddy was one of the biggest moonshiners. You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. What we call cat. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, now nah, you already was, know. You know what I'm saying? Like, he had the, you know what I'm saying? He had the, you know what I mean? He had the cat. Like, he had the liquor house. That's where everybody went to. Hell yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? Me growing up, you know, you know what I'm saying? My daddy come get me, and, and we, on Sunday, we go chill with my granddaddy. You know what I'm saying? My granddaddy getting older, and my daddy is really, I'm not knowing, I'm a kid, my daddy is really going over there to kind of help my granddaddy watch the money. Got you, okay. So I kind of like growed up in the liquor house. Yeah, got you. You know what I mean? Okay. Like, so, you know, of course it's liquor, but you know, there's other things. You yeah, know what I'm saying? But I, exactly. I kind of like, you know what I'm saying? I, I, you know, and I see, I see, you know what I'm saying? Like, I see, you know, I see what's going on. I, I, I watch everything, so uh-huh. you know what I mean, I, that's it. I just been around the hospital. Gotcha. It's so, it, man. so when you, so what year was it when you caught your first charge? My first charge, <laughs> bro, 
can't even remember my first charge. I probably, <laughs> <laughs> bro, I got my first charge. Like, I can't even remember. Nigga was still a Pee Wee. Yeah, Charlotte was, nigga yeah, said Pee like, Wee. Like, Pee like, Wee. Gotcha. Right, so, so the so the legend is Cheddar Man. I'm gonna tell you when 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 I first started hearing about you. I mean, this was before I even moved to Charlotte. I was still in Charleston. Yeah. The legend was Cheddar Man got hit with two bricks. That nigga Cheddar Man got hit with the most work in the history of Rock Hill. You know what I'm saying? And and, and, and here we are, you know, 2018, and, and niggas are still saying that Cheddar Man got hit with the most bricks ever seen in Rock Hill. You know what I'm saying? Is that a myth or or, or is that just a little exaggerated or is that shit fact? Well, uh, Cheddar guy, but actually what they talking about, that's Cheddar's second beat. Damn. Okay, so let let's we gonna get it. Let's do let's do the first bid. Damn. Okay, boy, you think you know somebody? Yeah, you really, you really don't like, know. You okay, know what I'm all right. So let's get into the first bid. The Chella first bid. Get with some work on his last bid. You know, gotcha. what I'm saying? A, a large. You know, we ain't gonna go into it because you know I understand them people still watching. Yeah, exactly. You know what I'm saying, but hey. you know. All right, so the first bid, what you get hit with, and how long did you do? Man? Okay, well I'm just gonna do like this here. That first bid. I was, Please I was, excuse me, the check calling. But anyway, go ahead. I was still a kid, um, so it wasn't just one charge, bro. Like gotcha. I had, I had drug charges. I had shooting charges. Damn. I had gun charges. Damn. I had just to say sum it up. We're gonna go from this, like, bro, from a in a period of January to September, I was out on five bonds. Damn. You know what I mean? From Jesus. shooting to drugs to guns to whatever. You know what I mean? Exactly, yeah. All so, tied in yeah, together. Yeah. So part anyway, of the lifestyle. I was sentenced to 15 years. State or fed? State. That's State? my first charge. I damn. was still a kid, yeah. Yeah, damn. So how much of that did you actually have to do? On that bid, um, you know, uh, I got another boy. You know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. Um, that was working with my first lawyer. Like, and th- when I'm telling you this, I didn't get all of my time because I had the bread to, you know what I'm saying? I, they didn't want me. They wanted me. It wasn't that they even wanted me. They wanted my brother. Exactly. So it was like, your bread, that, you know, okay, we're going to take some of it, but we ain't going to let you out because we really want your brother. Like, they was just, you know what I'm saying? So I, 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 I took it. And I went, you know what I'm saying? But I, I got 15, and I ended up doing, like, about four. Got you. Got you. So, shit, the nigga get back out, and, and, and you must have went right back in. Nigga I ain't learned from the four. You dodged the bullet. Like, like, went back in, like, when I was in, I was going in. <laughs> like, what the <laughs> Like, come on, bro. Like, yeah, no, you know, went back in, yeah. like, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like. Bro, if anybody would tell you, you know what I'm saying? I, I never say I'm the toughest guy. Uh, I'm the roughest guy. I'm uh, the big. I don't do that. You know what I'm saying? Got you. Nah, I feel you. I'm me. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Hey, everybody yeah. talking about they the realest in that. I, I, look. Man, you that, know how that, you know that, how that, that go. Listen, you know how that go. That don't matter to me. Because I had to identify what real is. And real is being real with self. So For with real. that being said... But you can't always ask about me. I'm the same person. Hell yeah. On the streets and in the penitentiary. You looking at a man that probably right now probably been on like 15, 20 prison yards. And I'm the same man. Listen, that's real. And you know what I do on every yard? I'm going to get some money. Okay. All right. I'm gonna get some work. Is that is that what is that what the, the the cheddar man came from? No, cheddar man came for that. Okay, all right, go ahead. I'm all gonna right. get some money. I'm gonna get some work. And you know what? While everybody else doing whatever they doing, I'm gonna get some women because there's some women in jail. Okay, all right. you hear me? Like, okay. don't right. listen. I don't know who come with all that homosexual stuff and all like that. That's for the people who not smart. I got you. I've been understood they, the game. They, they, get, they, get, tri- they get tricked out like, their booty hole. Because I, I understand. Like, yeah. I understand. Prisons is put in low-income areas. Oh, no. We you know that. Yeah, so, no. you put me at a prison where a lot of broke women are, and I got the bag. 
Like, Bro, stop yeah. playing with me. Listen, listen. Hey, listen, it's, it's, ba- it's basic economics. You, <laughs> you know, know what I mean? Like, it's I, basic law. You see what I'm saying? So nah, I, right. I figured it out. You know, yeah. they make it $12 an hour, and you know, a nigga, nigga behind bars still twerking. You like, know? come on, y'all. You know that he. Bro, I, had, I and this is no lie. Like, I got people okay. that vouch. Like, you know, shift change like 6 or 7 o'clock. Ladies leave at 6 or 7 o'clock. By eight nine o'clock, they calling me on my cell phone. Damn. They at home calling me on my cell phone. Damn, that they ball. <laughs> okay, like bro, I like, quit it. playing with me. Listen, that's, that's, that's real. <laughs> Listen, that's real. So, so, okay, so check it. When I, so check it. The nigga came home from his first bid. How long was it before you went back in to do the second one? About, about like, I say about, about, about four years. About four oh, okay. Years. All right. So you had a little run. You had a little... Yeah, I had a nice was, run. Like was, like was, when I came out here, like, bro, I really turned off some more. Like, got you. real. Like, yeah, because shit, when you, when you came back, like, that's when you set a, a record. Like, you, set, you set a record. Like I said, the legend is Cheddar Man got hit with the most bricks or, or, or the biggest bust in the history of Rock Hill. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but so actually, you see, that's kind of me because I actually right. didn't get hit in Rock Hill. Gotcha, so, okay. Um, All right. I got hit out of state. You know what I mean? Damn. But, you know, I was also at a good position with the music because at the time, you know what, like I was doing shows with like Trillville, Crime Mob. Scrappy, gotcha. hanging around, you know, you know, like when Lil John, them, BME, you know, the whole, they hope that whole BME, like, gotcha. bro, I was, I was there, yeah, like, Bo Hagen, and all, all them, yeah, all everybody, yeah. I was, okay. I was in that whole the circle, whole circle. There. Yeah. that whole circle, you know what I'm saying? Like, gotcha. I was in Atlanta. Actually, bro, when I got hit, I was, we was, that was, um, that was. What, 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 um, the beach in Florida, uh, it was, what, Spring Bling? Yeah. Miami Beach? Not Miami. The, uh, Daytona, Daytona Beach. They told it was okay. Daytona I, Weekend. I, I, it was I, Daytona gotcha. Weekend. Yeah, yeah, I got yeah. hit. Yeah, Spring, Spring Break I got, Weekend. Yeah. I got hit. Daytona Weekend. I was trying to make a play, and I was going to make the play and take the, I had some money with me. I was going to make the play and go buy me a new Range Rover and drive it to Daytona Beach. Damn. You know what I mean? I well, got li- well, listen, that, well, well, listen they, they did say that you was extremely flamboyant around this <laughs> motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? You wasn't trying to be discreet now. Well, you, you know, know what I'm saying? Like, they, bro, like, you know, they did say Cheddar was hot in this bitch because the nigga was far from discreet. You like, bro, you can't, you listen, bro, you can't, I, you don't get a, a young, Country nigga, a bunch of money. Like, what, yeah, what, nah, you what already know what's about to happen. Like, <laughs> nah, 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 nah you're you, right, you're you right. know, like, bro, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a keeping this is gonna keep it all the way funky with y'all. Like, I'm a country nigga, you know what I'm saying? So y'all yeah. gotta understand that. So, like, I come up like. You know what I'm saying? Having to go, like I'm telling you about my granddad. I'm, my granddad and them got me over there feeding the hogs and, and Bill and Hay and all this stuff, yeah, right? Yeah, I'm the over here, I'm over yeah, here. Yeah, I'm a kid shit. over here sweating, yeah. right? I'm over here sweating. They got me over here sweating and they give me $2. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. God damn, boy. You see what I'm saying? Slave you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I'm over here like this. I'm over here bigger cotton. You know what I mean? Yeah. Nah, and then, really. listen, now, you, you do this. I did all that for $2. Uh-huh. And you gonna tell me you gonna give me this, and all I gotta do is stand out here and what I can make. So you tell me I've been picking cotton and goddamn uh, no, eating I, hogs, listen, and nah, bell and hay, listen, and all this, all day. You ain't and no I got two dollars. So you tell me if I stand out here for four hours, I can make a band, and y'all don't wanna do this? Like y'all crazy? I'm gonna stay out here till I don't need no sleep. Nah, listen, I feel you, and that's what I did. Like hell yeah. I came, when I came at it, I was like, hey, well, no, nah, I feel you. Oh. Like, y'all crazy. Like, I just, the bag coming. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, hell yeah. Like, hell like yeah. bro, y'all, well, y'all, where y'all going to? No, no, no. Like, I'm still like, like yeah, nah, you know what I'm saying? Now, nah, listen, I, I get it. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's why it's called a trap. You know what I'm saying? Because it will trap you in, especially if you're from an area like where we from, where the opportunity is not exactly the best yeah. for people, not just 
from our, 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 our color, but from our area. You know, sometimes the area you in, you know, shit. That's even worse than the color of your skin because the, the opportunity ain't there. It it don't motherfucking matter whether you black or white. You yeah, know what like, I'm saying? And like with the trap situation, you know what I'm saying? It, I agree with that, but do you remember where that word kind of derived from? Yeah. What yeah. was in the first, what, what did trap mean in the beginning? She trapping meant, you know, standing in the trap, getting the money. It was no. the actual location. No. The trap. No. No? Okay. The Ed, trap, educate the me. Because you older than me. Educate the, me. No, I ain't older than you. Man, yeah, man, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. <laughs> I, 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 go I just been out here. <laughs> but actually, you know what I'm saying? If you go back to the, you know what I mean? Because I've been in prison. So I read all the Donald Goins and the Iceberg Slim. Trap, Got you. The trap. Trap was the term for money. Got you. Okay. You see yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. Trapping, getting that paper. No, yeah, it was, yeah. I better have my trap. It was, I better have my money. Yeah, trap slang, was slang for the actual cash money. itself. Yes, that's gotcha. what it was. Okay, all right. Like, yeah, yeah. So, you know, I mean, you know, they came later, but if you go back to the Iceberg Slim. Yeah, you know shit, I, like, I used to read all like, the Naked Soul you know, Iceberg Slim. Yeah, yeah, like, I, I, I you know, you know the that. horse son, all yeah, that. Horse son, come on. You know, you know what I mean? Like, everything. Like, that was. Now, listen, we speaking a foreign language to him now. You know what I mean? Like, I read a foreign language to him. You know what I mean? Like, for real. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that was. But bro, I was, I was, that's, that was me, you know what I'm saying? I'm Hell like, yeah. Just, I'm the same person, man. Gotcha. Know? Hell yeah. And, that, and that's real, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, uh, you said you recorded your first song in prison. Yeah. How the fuck did you manage to do that? Like, what, um, like first off, the equipment, like, what you even record this shit on? We had, you know what I'm we, saying? You know, back in the day, you, you had the big boom boxes. Gotcha, okay. So, we took one boom box, and we played the beat. Took the other boom box and put the tape in it. Gotcha. And it had the mic in the bitch. No, no, no. Nobody right. had the mic and in the bitch. It was in the in the Okay. I right, hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? My, shout out my nigga stuff. You know what I mean? He was, he, he was stuff. My nigga stuff. He was on a, on a 25. I was on a 15. Like I was on a level three yard. I was at Broad Roof. Oh, you know what okay. I'm yeah, I was yeah. on a level three yard. Like that's about me. You know what I mean? <laughs> like that's about me throughout the whole system. Like in the world. Like that's about me. They know me. Okay, you know I mean? so so do you remember your first rhyme or you don't remember that? Nah, first time? I don't remember. Remember I don't even remember. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna tell you a lie. I don't you even got, remember. But. All right, so when, so obviously you started fucking around for fun. You started rapping for fun. What made you say like? Okay, no, I, I could, wasn't for fun. I was like trying to. I wanted to. Oh, okay. So it. you so out, yeah, out the was, gate, yeah, you was yeah, like this me. I, yeah, like I was okay. Like, I had did a few little rhymes while I was on the street, but you know what I'm saying? But when I got in jail, like I, I was kind of serious. Okay. And when I got out, out of, on my first beat, that's when that's when I became Cheddar Man. Before Cheddar then, Man. Gotcha. Before then, I was boom. Gotcha. Okay. All right. I so, was, right, I was so, boom because I would gotcha. boom, boom. You gotcha. know what I mean? I was, right. young, I was a young high Yeah, kid. young nigga. All right. You so, know what I'm saying? So, so the switch from boom to Cheddar Man came... When the focus was not on violence, but on the money. On the money. Getting the bag. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. All yeah. right. Now it makes sense. So, all right. The second bid. You said, the, the legend says you got hemmed up with, with, with the most work ever in the history of, <laughs> you know, York yeah. County. Yeah. So, that was a fair charge, wasn't it? I mean, I did a little bit of both. You okay. You did, you did so a fair and did a state. Mean, gotcha. Just, but one thing you know. I ain't tell on nobody. Gotcha. Okay. Listen, uh, listen, cause that, listen, cause that, listen. I tell you this: there are a lot of there are a lot of rumors about a lot of rappers and a listen lot of him. people. That's one thing. You know what listen, I'm we stop the rumors. And I didn't did this, and I didn't did this for too many years. I tell you, like a couple years ago, I say I got ten. If somebody can say I got some paperwork, this year it's eighteen. I got a hundred. If you can say my name. Is on some paperwork where I snitch on somebody. Boom. There like, it is. Bro, I ain't with it. Listen, like, bro, listen, I, either y'all can bring the money or shut up. You know what I'm saying? You know and what that's, I'm saying? Bro, it's not even. Listen, I when you, you know, people just getting in it. Bro, I was bred in this. Like, All hey, day. Now, they didn't want me in this, but once I got in it, they my family started accepting me. Like my bro, my yeah. big bro quit there, like he he started sitting me down and kind of like, bro, bro, like just give me. Giving me classes. Yeah. You see what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. So that was yeah, what, giving you that OG game. You see what I'm saying? Like, bro, I was 15 with a hundred. 
Mm. Listen, these niggas be 15 and... and yeah, yeah, about yeah. to die. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, nigga be borrowing yeah, a baby mama car. Like, like, exactly. bro, come <laughs> on, man. Like, they know me. Like, bro, <laughs> by the time yeah, I was 16, bro, I, you know what I'm saying? I got like five, six cars, two motorcycles. Like, ask about me. Hell yeah. Like, it's for real. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> listen, no, that, I already, listen, I already told you. Yeah. You know, the, the rumors was not that you was... You know, low key, like the, the rumors was, you know, you was very flashy. Like that nigga Cheddar Man was about to get hit regardless. Like that nigga was just like, fuck everybody, the police, the DEA, Rock Hill, PD, York County, the South Carolina State Troopers. Like they were like that nigga was was you know that nigga was not humble, the least bit subtle about what he did or how he lived. Now you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, yeah. All right, so let's get into. You in your second bid. When you come home, obviously you said, I can't even do this shit no more. Even if I wanted to, because a nigga just so hot. So no, that's not true. That's not true. God <laughs> damn, bro. This, 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 this nigga here, man. God, man you want me to get a phone with me? No, no, no. no, no, that's, no that's, what, that's what we want. That's what we want. All right. Well, okay, I'm going to keep right. it like, like this here. Okay. And I'm going to be, I'm going to like, listen. Chuck T. I just bought a new tractor trailer truck yesterday. Exactly. Yeah, man. But we know you got a million businesses. Now. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? saying. Like, what I'm saying? Like, we know so, it ain't yeah, tight money now. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I'm trying to pinpoint when you finally said enough of the street <laughs> shit, bro. Like I can't do it no more. I don't know. Man, we <laughs> man. This no, is tight truck right here, man. Like, so, like we. Like nah, bro. Like I ain't gonna tell a lie. Like yeah. I'm, I'm really. It, it, it took a, you know, it took a long time to to make the transition. No, it, I understood. Like, and I still, like niggas call me and I be like, oh, oh, oh. yeah, and you be nah. like, nah, bro, I'm straight. <laughs> nah, I'm I be like, like, I be like, I'm straight with her. I be like, if they drop the number one, one. <laughs> yeah, make a nigga I'm consider. Going. You know what I'm saying? Like, 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 I'm going. Yeah, make, make a nigga you know, consider. But, you know, you know I feel like, it, more than anything, you know, bro, like, now, um, my, ki- you know, what really, I, and I, I ain't going to tell them, like, I'm going to keep it uh-huh. funky. Like, in the last couple of years, um, my, I, got a, I got a little boy, you know what I'm saying? And, mm-hmm. and I was just like, you know, um, I ain't gonna say, you know, everybody gonna say whatever. I ain't gonna say my daddy been the worst. I ain't gonna say he been the best. Gotcha. No, none of that. You know what I'm saying? Me and my mama actually, we just had a dispute about my daddy today. She was talking junk about my daddy. I said, hold. Now, that's yeah, yeah, my daddy. yeah, 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 yeah. You know what yeah, I'm saying? had to take up for him. You know what I'm saying? I was a hold. Yeah. That's my daddy. Now, listen. Listen, man, listen, ain't nothing wrong you know with that. that. You know what I'm saying? Because we all hoping that <laughs> yeah. eventually we get to the yeah. point where when our baby mamas get to that yeah, talking, I'm like, you know, oh, our kids be like, you know? I was like, oh, he might have been a bad... Boyfriend, husband, whatever to you, but he was the best daddy I ever had. I told her that. I told yeah. her just like she don't like, she ain't like that. Hell yeah, nah, like, they never do. But you know, I was like, you know, so real on the real talk, bro. Like what really kind of um, humbled me down is I got a I got a little son, and um, you know, it's like, bro, I I, I want to be there for him. Always, so, always, always. But with my son, you know what I'm saying? Like, I just, I just like, you know, I've been out of my door. I got an older daughter. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That's that, that's older. And I ain't been in her life. You know what I mean? Like, I've been in her life bits and pieces. I probably, you know, I've been out a lot. I've been out over half of her life. Yeah, because the nigga did what you did. You did both them bids. We did both of them bids in, you know, 10 years. You know what I'm saying? So, um, like, out of everything, you know I laugh and I joke, but that's what I'm really, you know what I'm saying? Like, right now I'm still, and we better now, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, me yeah. and my daughter. No, nah, that's a really, hundred. Like, really, like, 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 like yeah, niggas like, need to hear that, you know, know what I'm saying? saying? Like, no. bro, like, after all, I'm not, I'm not the one going to never tell nobody not to hustle. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? I ain't, that ain't, I ain't going to never tell you not to hustle, but I'm going to just tell you. If you hustle, if you pick this side of the law, stay on this side of the law. Gotcha. 
When regular people call the police and people say that's snitching, that's not snitching. Because regular people are supposed to uphold the law. Uphold the law. Exactly. But when you know we on this side of the law and you calling people, I don't like that. Because no, listen, this is what ain't nobody make you get over here. No, you're right. You, you know hopped over there because you wanted you, to. You, you see what I'm saying? Yeah. So now I know where I'm at. I know, listen, I got too much at stake. So, I don't need to be on this side of the law. I need to be over here for exactly. my longevity. All right. You know what I'm saying? All right. And as you get older, you start understanding, like, I was over here. I thought I needed everything. I thought I need all the clothes. I thought I need all the girls. I thought I need all of this, and I needed all of that, and all of that. But now, I'm like, okay, just let me be okay. Mm -hmm. And now, I'm like, listen, I'm tired of the Carolinas. Not getting the recognition that they need. Listen, and and listen, I feel you. Listen, I feel you. So so now that we on that, let's get into let's get into the music. Okay. Since we since we talking about the Carolinas not getting the recognition, you were a pioneer of music in this area. Yes. What was some of the even with all the money you had? What were some of the hardships that you went through trying to just get your music out? Because, I mean, it was never easy, you know, shit. Nah, you could burn that road up and you could have that paper. And, you know, them Atlanta niggas and them New York niggas, they'll swindle you out every fucking dollar, well, you know? I, I can at least say, like, you know what I'm saying? I ain't never been no dummy. You know, I always had a, say, a saying. I was country when country wasn't cool. Exactly. No, I was you're right. country when I ain't nobody country fool. Hey, you know what I mean? Hey, that's real. You see what I'm saying? That's like, real. I, I mean, I'm country, but, you know what I'm saying? That that I ain't unintelligent. Yeah, no, nah, you see right. what I'm saying? Hell yeah. And actually on this on my last bid, I got a degree in business. I was on the dean's list. Shit, that's listen. That, listen man, one time for the homie Cheddar <laughs> bag, bro. That's real. Listen, that's yeah. real, okay? Old college boy, you know what I'm saying? You know what he, he don't put that out there. He's an old college nigga, he man. He's a college nigga, <laughs> man. In the, in the pen, like, bro, and I tell you, like, uh, that is the roughest place to even try to stay focused at. Nah, I, listen, you know I what get man? it. Like, I ain't never done bro. a bid, but boy, I trust me. You I know get what I'm it. Saying, man. But I stay focused. And, and listen, and I was still the same guy. Like, I still could connect, you know, I wish. I was able to go to, you know, a, a, a regular college nah, because, you know what I'm saying, bro, to be honest with you, and that's to keep it 100, like, some of the guys that I've been locked up with, I feel like we in some type of fraternity. Fraternity, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because, yeah. like, we, bro, we, 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 we keep it... We keep it a hundred with each yeah. other. You know, we call and check on each yeah, other. Yeah, fan side fan. You know what I'm saying? You know like, bro, what I'm we, 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 you know what I'm saying? It's like, bro, like, last Sunday, you know what I'm saying? My, my man, he just came up from Atlanta. Like, he called, he tell everybody, that's my bro. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's bro, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, nah, that's, that's a hundred. You know? That's a hundred, so shit. With the music, what, what did you have to go through just to get the name that you got? Because, I mean, shit, it was... It, you you had to plow the field, you know what well, I'm saying? Like I, like I tell you, actually when it, with the music, bro, I had some more guys. I wasn't even wanting to rap, like, cause when I came back on my first bid, I was just worried about the money. But I, I tried to help other guys, and they didn't really, you know, when you don't got nothing to invest, it, you don't got nothing to lose. Exactly, gotcha. And that's how. I, I kind of, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, sort of like Jeezy. You know, Jeezy put his money in the other niggas. Everybody getting locked up and dead. He had two of his artists get killed. And finally, he was like, well, fuck it. I done bought all this fucking equipment. You know what I'm saying? Nigga may as well try it, you know? Yeah, so that's what I mean. Same thing. I ain't even going to go into details. Yeah. Them still my people. And I can't even, like, bro, like with them, them people down there, okay, I can kind of blame you. But up here, bro, it's just like, we were just uneducated. We just didn't know. Yeah. But we wanted, we seen it and we wanted it, but we just ain't know how to gotcha. go about it. Yeah, so, so, when, so when did you start Shine Time the label? I Actually, I started Shine Time on, in, on my first first, on first business. business. Okay, like, so you I had started it, a little minute. Ago. I started it then, you know what I'm saying? Like right before I came home with one of my one of my partners and I was like, like, bro, I'm finna start this. And he like, bro, when I get out, like, I'm with you. You know what I'm saying? Gotcha. You know, shout out gotcha. to Twin. You know what I'm saying? That's my nigga, like, regardless. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
if if this is one dude, if you don't never see me with, you know what I mean? You don't never see me with Weezy, like, that's still my dog. Like, that's, hey, hey hands down. Like, Hell yeah. nah, you know that's what I'm a saying? Hundred. Like, all yeah, the way. That's a hundred. So, shit, all right, when I when I it was introduced to you, when I first met you, you know, Shine Time, the label, was moving like, a, 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 a no limit cash money rough yeah, yeah, riding yeah. type team, you know. Um, naturally, you've gone into a little detail about why the crew has slimmed down. Yeah, you know, you've consistently put out music, but you 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 have a reinvigorating fire right now. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because I know you 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 know you do the club shit. You know what I'm saying? You got Shine Time the store. You know what I'm saying? Now you got the dump trucks. You know what I'm saying? The track the trailer. The track the trailer. I'm sorry. So you end up and the whole trucking company. Exactly. Whole trucking. All right. So (laughs) your focus hasn't been on music, but when you called me the other day, you said Chuck T. Bro, I'm about to go back in. You know what I'm saying? What made you say fuck it? Because you could be comfortable and not even waste no money on music. You know what I'm saying? You you can sit back and just live. What's making you say, fuck it, I'm going to put my money in the music? Well, because, bro, like you said, like I said before, I'm tired of them people kind of, and I can't even say them people because I ain't going to do that because, yeah. you know, I'm just, I want my pe- my people to get a little bit more educated. Your people as in the Car- Carolinas. 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 Gotcha. I'm Carolina till I die, bro. Like gotcha. I'm Shine Time for life, bro. I'm Carolina till I die. Hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? So um Yeah, and you 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 from the same time period I'm from where nobody wanted to be from the Carolinas. Everybody wanted to be from New York or Atlanta. And like, bro, you know that, that, see that's kinda <laughs> like one of the things, you know what I'm saying? Like before I caught my last beard, like we was uh-huh. kinda I, I started linking up. That's when I was rocking with everybody from the Chuck. That's when I was rocking with JD Hall, exactly. TR Flow. That's when me and Collard Green was going, me and Collard Green and some more guys from Columbia was going to Charleston. And then the guys from Charleston and the guys from Columbia was coming up here to Charlotte. Because I've been in Charlotte. Like, yeah, hell been, yeah. You know, I'm from South Carolina, but little people know, like, bro, I've been in, I've been in Charlotte, like, probably, like, since... Man, like probably like ninety five, bro. Hell yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. So Hell like, yeah. but I just you know I you know I stay to you know what I mean. I kind of yeah, no, yeah. cause Hell I be, yeah. you know what I'm saying. Like I ain't, you know you you know how I go, y'all. Yeah, you know no, what I'm saying. No, 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 I, Everything I ain't always been legit with me. Yeah, <laughs> no. Nah, okay, so check it. Let's get into uh, we, we we I just named some of the things that you got your hand in. Yeah, but now you are. Also, a movie producer. Yeah. Tell us about the movie. It's called Team, right? Yeah. Like, and, it, and it's right along the same lines of what you're saying, that, that yeah, togetherness, like, that unity. Yeah, like, what, what, the, what does it stand for? What does Team stand team for? Team stands T-A-M. for uh, Together Everyone Accomplishes More. Um, okay. You know, All right. What's the movie about? Me, I came up with an idea. You know what I'm saying? I'm the executive producer. Um, My dog. Professor Chop, you know what I'm saying? Okay, yeah, from the 864. He's from the upstate. You know what I mean? Yeah, Hell he, yeah. He, he, he put shout it, out you know what I'm Chop, saying? Yeah. Yes, most definitely shout out to Professor Chop, how y'all want to call it. So, um, um, you know, I was like, bro, he already kind of been in the movies doing a little stuff. You yeah, know he was shooting so videos. Like, yeah, 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 most definitely. Yeah. I'll shoot all my videos. So, I'm like, bro, I got this, this idea. you like, Come on, like let's write it. You know what I'm saying? I didn't know how to write, so he kind of helping me, and mostly he doing it. So yeah. okay, like you know what I mean? You know I got the ideas, and we, so we got the movie. But 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 the movie I went, Chop said, okay, this is how much the budget is. Okay, right here. So I said, okay, at our time in in that Rock Hill, that whole York County, Tri County. I'm just gonna say the Tri County area. Gotcha. We everybody what, what, what always that, yeah. York Chester and what? Yeah, York York County, Chester County, Lancaster County. Gotcha. You know what I'm Lancaster. saying gotcha. everybody. Okay. That's like a whole little network, right? There. Exactly. Yeah. So, Hell so yeah. I, I'm like, I go to everybody, like you know, everybody in the area, and I'm like, okay, child, like, bro, we probably can kick it all really for probably like. 10 bands, you know what I'm saying? Something gotcha. Like that. So I go to like six different groups, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, okay, I got Chuck T. Right, he got his people, and I got such and such, and he got his people behind him. And so I'm, I went to six different groups, and I'm like, I, I put everybody at the round table. I'm like, listen, bro, we're going to shoot this movie, bro. We're going to probably have to spend about 
seventeen hundred, something like that. I can't remember exactly, but it went yeah. in two bands. And I'm like, listen, we're gonna start in a month. Like when we meet again, everybody bring seven fifty, and let's do the move. Exactly. So, yeah, yeah. To start it off, it was like ten bands. I think at the end it was gonna be more, but. Just to kick yeah. it off, it's like 10 bands. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, everybody, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Next week. Damn. So, you basically had to do it by yourself, or? I got well, it wasn't one of, six, it was two, or was it wasn't yeah, three. Yeah, it was like, it was two. My, my, shout out my dog, Kenny Wayne. He came back, my little cousin, Kenny Wayne. Gotcha. But this is the thing, like, bro, Chop been charging y'all. Six and seven hundred dollars for you know video. yeah videos yeah so a nigga could have came with that for the movie you know what I'm saying for something full length full feature you know what I'm saying like chopping Charlie you know what I'm saying basically like come what what is it I don't understand yeah now nah, I get it so shit what's the movie about give me the, give me the, the plot give me the give me the storyline you know what I'm saying everybody working together and actually the movie ain't even about everybody. The, the movie really was to show how I really tried to get everybody together, but how we so much separated. Gotcha. Because you know what I'm saying, like the movie depicts uh you mad you ain't even mad at me. You mad at him. Cause I'm messing with his girlfriend or something like that. Gotcha, yeah, some petty shit. You know what I'm saying? Or you mad, I'm mad at you because what I heard. Gotcha. Never no 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 really no justification. That's you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Grab that dog. Should be so bad that dog. Yeah, go ahead. Like go ahead. no yeah. justification. It's just, you know what I'm saying? Just nothing. Like just mad. People mad at each other. And at the long in the long run, that's what we dealing with, bro. Like we got so much separation. Separation and, and animosity. And everything. Like it's just yeah. sad. Like bro. Like, bro, like, really, I, you know what I'm saying? Like, I really be in the A like that, like that. So, hell yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, you know what I mean? You know, we didn't have clubs in the A. So, you know, I, I understand. And I started really politicking and moving with people in the A. Hell and yeah. I started seeing, like, okay, I understand. They don't want us in. You know nah, for real. Nah, listen. I they, can't they, look, hold on, hold on. Let me, they, 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 I mean, let me, I'll put it this way. They handle their business like how I, we should handle ours. You know what I'm saying? I ain't well, even going to say they don't look, want us in. But they We got to pay dues. And we got to we gotta make sure that they are involved. You know? Ain't nothing wrong with that. That's how we should be with our unit. Y'all can come in. We want to eat with y'all. But y'all ain't about to eat off of us. Well, that's but a, we that's, let everybody that, eat yeah, off they, of us. They eat off of us. I ain't yeah, even you know saying. Like, I'm going to keep it going. Because there is some people that... It's some people that want to help, but it's like, bro, we know, like, bro, I can, I can book, I can book an artist tomorrow from Atlanta in Atlanta for five, and if I say Carolina, it's ten. Exactly. No, you're right. You're right. You know what I'm saying? So while we talking, while we, while we on that right there, you know, um, she eventually with the new single. They gonna have to put that bag up for Cheddar, man, cause you say you ready for Cheddar. I'm sorry, we done dropped the man. You say you got the new single that's gonna make everybody basically get on board. Well, you know what I'm saying? Well, tell, tell me about the new single, real well, quick. Well, I ain't even gonna say the new single. It's just I'm coming and, and I'm gonna be, you know, I'm gonna be consistent. Gotcha. Okay. I'm gonna be more consistent. It ain't you even sure you gonna be able to focus? Cause you do a lot, my nigga. You you Bro, got a lot going on. Bro, like, you know, y'all might not see this man behind this camera, but bro, and I got, it's a man over there behind that camera that's going to be with me 100%. Gotcha. Okay. Oh, yeah, yep. yeah, yeah. He yeah. over there and just, we going to leave him over there. And then I got some more people that's like, you know, it's like they going to be, bro, my face good. Gotcha. My face. Hell yeah. I, look. Shut don't owe nobody, no will. You can ask about that. You don't owe nobody. Yeah, man. 
Oh, you know what I mean? They, you know what I'm nah, saying? I'm the same person. So, you know, it's, it's, it's people, I don't, and I'm not the person that try to burn my favors. I, I, you know what I'm saying? I don't burn no bridges, nor do I burn favors. Hell so yeah. I'm, I'm at that point, like, bro, I'm, I'm on go. Hell yeah. So, so I, I know we got to wrap it up because you got to get to the club. Yeah, I got to get You know what I'm saying? So, to introduce the new single. Tell us about the new single, man. What's the new, the new single? The new single is... Featuring Chesley Boy. Okay. You know what I'm saying? It's off the Teen Movie soundtrack. It's called Get to the Money. Gotcha. Now, you was telling me about another one you working on, too. You said you got something for the ladies. Yeah, you ain't never yeah, did nothing for the ladies. For the ladies. You, you ain't, ain't never done next up. Yeah. Okay. Well, 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 who, who you got on that one? Because I know you're not you know singing saying? the hook like, yourself. You know, we, 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 I'm putting a Kibius on that. Okay. You know all right. Mean? All right. The Kibius. Shout out to a Kibius. Shout out to a Kibius. Gotcha. You know what I mean? That's my dog, man. You know what I mean? Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right. So, she. All right. Shout out to Zay Beats. You know what I mean? On the production. Shout out to Chizzy Boy. You know what I mean? Got gotcha. you. more than likely do all the vocals. And the Hell yeah. All right. Well, she. Go ahead and tell everybody where they can find you online and, 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 and tell them where they can watch that team movie. At. Um, actually, we, went, we haven't went. Um, we haven't went. You know, like to the internet with the movie. Got you still hand to hand that thing. Hand hand oh, that's yeah, real. Man. That's real. And the pack in, bro. You got you. Okay. Yeah, I mean, okay. yeah, you gotta get that pack in. I gotta get that pack in. Yeah, I mean, the pack in. I gotta get the pack in. Tell them where they can find you. You know, you you can call me, bro. I'm still the same. Yeah, I mean, yeah. But tell tell them the social media first. Most definitely, most definitely, I'm gonna do that. Yeah, I'm saying. You know, listen, this is gonna be all over the internet. Yeah, bro. You don't want niggas calling you from China. Yeah, got them Brazil they just got bro, them calling the call. I had the same phone number since 1993. Jesus. Come on, bro. Yeah, you, you, got, you got me beat. I, I, had, the, I had the same one since 2007. <laughs> so I done had my 10 bro. years. You 93 like, in that on, thing. Bro. Okay, give us the social media. Yeah, give us the um, social media. I'm Cheddar 49. You know Cheddar 49. Cheddar 49 on um, Instagram. I don't know how to work Snapchat. I ain't going to lie. I so, feel uh, you, I, my dog, I got to get my kids. They trying to teach me. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Listen, nah, I feel you. I feel but, you. But, um, you know what I'm saying? I'm Cheddar 49 on Instagram. Um, on Facebook, uh, if you're in, you in Charlotte, I'm Cheddar Man Charlotte. If you're in the Tri-County, York County area, um, Titus Burris. If you're in Atlanta, I'm Cheddar Man Atlanta. Damn. If you in Columbia, I'm Cheddar Man in Columbia. Okay. Yeah, right. I probably got like, you, you just start yeah. Cheddar, Cheddar Man and put the city back. Yeah, exactly. Like, it'll, it'll pop up on the You know what I'm saying? Uh, gotcha. I'm Dynasty Nightlife. I'm uh, Shine Time. You know what I mean? Uh, yep, Dynasty Nightlife is the club. <laughs> Shine Time is the stove. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I feel it. Hell yeah. So, you know, bro, but uh, the, the one that you can really, um, Cheddar Man Charlotte and the Titus Birds. Got on you. Facebook. All right. So there it is. DJ Chuck T, Rap Wire TV. I'm with the homie Cheddar, a.k.a. Cheddar Man, a.k.a. What, what was it? Uh, B- Boom. Boom, a.k.a. Boom. And she, we out this motherfucker, man. Right. Uh, uh. You think it's a good one? Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. All right, all right. 50 minutes, I told you an hour. What time is it, bro? You gonna make me miss it.